So, what do you guys want to do today? I don't know. I'm kind of bored. Go to a museum. Oh, no. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I know what we should do. What? Do you guys feel... Oh, do you oh, guys... Wait, yeah, yeah. wait I don't oh, know. God, okay. I don't know. Should we all say it on three? Wait, hold on. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> wait. Say it on three. One, <laughs> two, two, three. Hacks! <laughs> Alright guys, let's do this. Let's make a game plan. All right, um, Eric, you're gonna be doing the hair mask hacks. Oh, got it. Do you yep. get? Can you handle that one? Got it. Great, Melissa. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm gonna put you on styling hacks. Okay. I'm gonna, we're okay. gonna do styling hacks. I think do that. Um, and I'm gonna take one for the team, and I'm gonna do the dry shampoo hacks. <gasps> oh my god. Oh. All right, you guys ready for this? Let's do yeah. this. Let's do this. <laughs> wants to try a new technique involving drawing on hair directly through a stencil. Pick out a star-shaped stencil, place it directly against the hair, and apply the color spray. The design turns out colorful and cosmic. It looks great on Linda. Let's do it. Do it. All right, I'm taking my stencil. Eric, we're going to spell your name Can on you your head. No, yes. Yeah. I've always wanted to do this. We're spelling your name on your head. Okay. Oh. Eric, don't move. <gasps> Oh. Wait. <laughs> what? You're telling me this entire Wait, you're thing? telling me I can write anything in my head? Uh oh. I fucked up. <laughs> Eric. <laughs> <laughs> this is a hack if I have ever seen one. Can you see it? We do it a dollar sign? Yeah, <laughs> to Eric, Eric, <laughs> Eric money. Oh, is it a word? Oh, Eric. It was really. <laughs> it's really cool. Let me do some art back here. I don't know what I'm doing. Stunt in. So, I don't know if I'd exactly call that one a hack, but uh, pretty fun. It's pretty good. <laughs> I, think, I think I'd call it a hack. I'd highly recommend yeah, spray painting your hair with stencils at some point and making it not look exactly. That's a hair hack! For this idea, we took regular bobby pins and pipe cleaners, green and yellow. Hot glue the bobby pins to both ends of the wire. Do the same with the other pieces of wire. Make a bun. Wrap it with yellow wire. Fasten the wire to the hair with hair pins. Insert the green wire bent in half in the middle of the bun. Bend the upper part slightly to make it look like leaves. With this summer fruit hairstyle, you will become the star of any beach party. Wow. Okay, Melissa. Yes, Dad. I mean, Brad. I mean, I don't I mean, know. I think that everybody needs to know mm -hmm. how to execute a pineapple bun. Exactly. And right. this is going to be the hack of the century. I love it. We're going to put SpongeBob to shame. To shame. To shame. So, Bikini Bottom could never. We got green and yellow pipe cleaners. Is that what they're called? Yeah, yeah pipe cleaners, pineapple cleaners. And we don't have a... um. A glue gun. So we're gonna make do what we have because uh, I failed at preparing. What a surprise. All right, so we're gonna just twist it on. They use glue like for literally no reason. Yeah, no. It's so extra. They just wanted to be extra. Wait, look at this one. It's like weird. Let's try and do just the um. Just the normal ones? Yeah. Not that there's anything wrong with being different. There's really not, but um, today there is. Yeah. Um, We got it. Step one complete. All right, Melissa, we're going to step two. We're making a bun. Okay. Have you ever had a bun, Melissa? Mm, I mean, this girl's had a bun or two in her life. <laughs> Wait, are your bun is done. Okay. So we're gonna move on to the next step. Buns are done. We're gonna build out <laughs> pineapple. Great. <laughs> okay, so they didn't really give me a lot of direction, but that's okay. <laughs> this is totally a hack. I know what when you wake up in the morning, Melissa, and you think, how am I ever gonna make this look like a pineapple? <laughs> yeah, the worst part is when I have to like use a real pineapple and just put it over my head. Oh, that's the worst. I know, you have to carve out the whole thing. <laughs> make sure <laughs> make sure it doesn't drip on you. Oh my god. <laughs> So, we're working around the bun. Eric, are we getting some uh, pineapple action in here? Yeah, 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 I see it, I see it, I see it. 
Oh. Wow, just what I've always wanted. It totally looks like a real pineapple. Perfect. Now, let's add some leaves. Can that head up, please? Make sure you stab their head on the way in. Love a good stab. Melissa well, really compliments your hair shape. <laughs> oh my god, thank you. This is no. what you're wearing out tonight, right? Oh yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. If this ain't it. <laughs> oh, oh damn. <laughs> oh shoot, you look good. Oh shoot, y'all do pineapple buns? Oh shoot. <laughs> if this ain't it, damn. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Yeah, ladies, wow. hide your man at home. Hide your man's yeah. hide your wife. Because this bun is coming out tonight. Listen, that's how you do a pineapple bun, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in case you were wondering about this hack. Yeah, Melissa, do you feel like you can easily accomplish this at home now um, in the morning by yourself? <laughs> yeah, totally. I don't have to use a real pineapple anymore. Melissa, take it away. That's a hair hack. Yeah, yeah. Hair hack. Hair hack. <laughs> So dry shampoo is a must for everybody. Might as well DIY it. So the mixture is pretty basic. We're mixing baking soda and cornstarch, and the levels are two thirds cornstarch to one third baking soda. Get ready for it to go everywhere. All right. So far so good. So far so good. Yeah. Wait, it yeah. Looks good. That looks really good. All right, I'm gonna bring Eric in for some help on this part. Eric has my whisk. I've got the whisk. Got the whisk. We just went on a city long mission to find baking soda and cornstarch. Corn this one's a little tricky this to find. <laughs> this is a little tricky one right we, here. Uh, we have a hard time finding that one. Bunch of places for that one. So onto the uh, third store. We're looking, just looking for cornstarch. Can't find it anywhere in New York City. Um, no grocery store has it, but we're still looking. I'll come back at you once we uh, have an update. Found it? I don't know. Um. Wow. Baking. Uh, baking. Oh. <laughs> of course. <laughs> the place right next to my house has cornstarch. Freddie, you, uh, more, mean, you, you get more cornstarch? Marty here. I might as well. <laughs> All right, we got everything we need. <laughs> We're gonna put a scoop of this in. Cornstarch. <laughs> That's a heaping scoop right there. All right. Oh, God, it's freaking. Right. Oh, really? A big help. So we're doing two thirds cornstarch to one third baking soda. Okay, so we're, we're going to do one more of these. One more of these. One more heaping scoop. Heaping scoop. So the cornstarch is going to take up the oils from your hair, and the baking soda is going to deodorize your hair. So that is what mm. we're doing today. Mm. And um, my hair is actually kind of clean because I just colored it. But. I just put a ton of oil in it. So in real life, it's like really greasy feeling. So we're gonna try and get that grease out. Mm. Eric, can you um, attest to that? It's very greasy. Mm. Yeah, it is very greasy. Qu very greasy, okay. <laughs> First step, we oh, do we need, need to, to whisk, whisk it, together. it together. That is very crucial, important step to this hack, kids. Seems like it's pretty whisked to me. Voila! <laughs> Blow out the microphone. Voila. <laughs> Final. Done. Okay, can we make this top a little bit? Be careful when you take it out. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Uh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, hold on, I need to get a little get it started. Alright, so now Eric's <laughs> gonna put this in my hair. Can we just do this side? Uh I don't know. Do oh, okay. So you just put it on the root. Oh, this side. Put it on the root. Kind of section out the hair and put it in there, alright? Wow. Is it working? Is it dry shampooing? Yeah, kind of rub it in. I think now. it is. I actually think it's working. Don't put too much on my, directly at my scalp. I do believe Ooh. this is working. It's definitely a new feeling having um, baking soda in your hair, but all right, this actually worked very nicely. Yeah, it looks, and honestly, it feels less greasy. A lot less greasy. It doesn't like feel too like textured from it. Like it feels very like fluffy still and nice. I kind of enjoy this. This is actually it not doesn't a bad- It doesn't really have a scent to it either. Yeah, no scent. Yeah. Kind of nice. Kind of hey, into it. Kind of nice. That hack, I think, uh, was it's pretty hack. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna make you look nice and ugly. Okay, mm -hmm. turn to the side. It's fine. All right, so basically, they take a piece of hair, mm -hmm. 
and they pin curl it, their fingers. It seems like this person might not be able to buy a curling iron or something, and they only have a flat iron, and for some reason- A lot of foil. They have foil laying around. Well, I mean, foil's pretty normal, but like for some reason, they don't want to curl it just using the flat iron. They want to put it in a foil. So, this is a good hair hack, huh? Ooh, cute though. <laughs> Oh, wait, that's like so cute. It's kind of cute. It's so like, cute. Let me do a smaller piece this time. Okay. Oh, we were just hacking away, huh? <laughs> yeah, just just hacking away. These are the hair hacks of the cinch. <laughs> oh my god, did you just say cinch? The cinch. I can't tell if I love that or if I really love that. I think you really love it. Ladies, follow along. Honestly though. Oh, that's actually so it's cute. Kind of nice. Yeah. Okay, five minute crafts. I see you. I don't know if it deserves the name hack. Yeah. It's kind of like a- It's actually just a longer way of doing something. It's actually like way more inconvenient. <laughs> Let's like leave that in and do another piece. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Soy cute. They're v -quiche. Ooh. Let's do this entire side with- Yeah, I just want to do one side. <laughs> I'm gonna see my crush, it'll be fine. Do a crush? Yeah, a little bit. We're at that point where I'm like imagining our lives together and I'm pretty sure he's gonna propose, but he also doesn't still doesn't know my, are. yeah, there, there's that part. So Taryn Egerton, if you're watching this. <gasps> Melissa. Oh my God, I know I moved on from Cole Sprash to him. Oh. oh my God, this is so cute. They're actually like decent. They're like, actually like amazing. They're very bouncy and voluminous and I don't hate it, so. Brad doesn't hate maybe it. Maybe a hair hack, maybe just a different way of curling. All right, let's brush it out and see what happens. Okay. Fun. Wait, it's so cute. It's so voluminous. Oh my God. Oh my God. Before, after. So Mel, mm -hmm. that one was actually kind of fun. Yeah, it was really fun. Like, it's my hair very is so bouncy, pretty. Yeah, it's, voluminous. Yeah, it kind of looks like I got it done professionally by try? a professional. <gasps> Would you ever do it at home? Um, ask me later. <laughs> That's another hack down. Yeah, that's a... What is it? Hair hack! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Look how pretty it is, guys. I'm going to be doing a hair mask for you guys today. So um, this hair mask involves a couple eggs, a tablespoon, a bowl, and some olive oil. The reason why I am doing the egg and olive oil mask is because it helps hair growth and strengthening your hair. So this is what it looks like. There's... One, and it goes right into the bowl of eggs. Here is two. You mix it together. I leave it in for around 30 minutes and then you can wash it out with shampoo and conditioner. Just, you know, normally wash your hair out. So this is what it looks like. Wow! Perfect, so now we got our bowl. We, have we got our, our oil. eggs that I'm not touching because I'm vegan. <laughs> The lucky one is this one. We're gonna do two of those, we're gonna do the entire egg, and let's get it done. Get it in there, Eric, get it in that bowl. Oh, I had to let's crack it? do it, yeah, here you go. <laughs> How else are you gonna put it on your head? Crushed it. <laughs> Crushed it. That's two for two. Oh. All right, and now we're gonna put a couple teaspoons of oil in here, two, and we're gonna mix it all up. You can mix it, Eric, why don't you go for that? I'm gonna whisk the egg and the oil together. <laughs> And then Eric, when we follow you to the shower, and then into a consistency like so, Eric's gonna shampoo his hair. Egg Let's do it. <laughs> All right, so Eric's hair is now <laughs> washed, and we're gonna blow dry, and then apply the eggs. Oh yeah, Eric, it's all you now. Apply that egg. I had to put this in my head. Yeah. I don't really want this in my hair. Note on the hack, it's really disgusting. Really gross. This. Oh, come, Brad. Do I actually think this is a hack? Why won't they just get some, like... Just go buy a hair mask, guys. Yo, if this don't work... Wait, let me, let me dip. Let me dip. Eric. 
Ew. Get your head out of the pool. Ew. I don't even want to touch it. <laughs> Let's comb it through. What do you have to? <laughs> oh no. Is that like combable? This is so gross. Brett, you're. All right, so Chloe said to wait 30 minutes, so we're gonna wait 30 minutes and we're gonna rinse this up and see if it makes any difference to Eric's hair. I hope so. <laughs> Brad, my hair literally feels like someone put an egg in it. Yeah, it doesn't feel any better. No, it feels way worse. It feels a little dry. Like, what is this? What is, it? wasn't this supposed to be a mask? Like, Brad, uh, look at this. Think, Eric, I don't think it's supposed to detangle, that's the thing. What is it? At protein and shine. It's a little hard to break through. All right, let's try it real quick. <laughs> There's no egg on my face. Did my egg in my face? <laughs> Running down Eric's face. There are scrambled eggs on my temple right now. Eric, can you get it off before I throw Is it up? gone? Is it gone? Is it gone? Yeah, sure. <laughs> it smells like an omelet. I mean, oh my, it's so shiny! <laughs> what the hell? It's pretty shiny, but um, it feels, would I recommend it? It feels no very dry and crispy. <laughs> oh my god, oh my, my head is crazy gosh. too. I'm gonna say that's a that's gonna be a no. That's gonna be a cut. A that's of, gonna be a do not try at home, kids. There's a lot easier way of getting shiny yeah. hair. Even honestly, can, just the olive oil. It, it literally, <laughs> you can even go to like the dollar store and buy yeah. a hair mask. I'm sure it'll be like, literally any decent, kind of oil better than that. <laughs> but you know what we call that? Hair hat. Yes. 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 <laughs> Apparently, you can curl your hair with a plastic bottle. Cut the neck off a plastic bottle and cut out a rectangular hole in the middle. Soak a strand of hair with water or some hair styling products and place the strand into the bottle. Now, turn on a hair dryer and point the stream of air through the opening so that the strand of hair starts moving around the inside of the bottle in a spiral. Voila! Betty ends up with a cute little curl. All right, Mel, so that's... The next one. Okay. How do we feel about that? It's actually really interesting. interesting. Like I've never seen anything like it before, but also like who came up with this? So we're gonna cut the bottom. Oh my god, focus this. on the knife. Stop. There we but, go. Stop. Okay, and now we're gonna cut another hole on this side like they did. Be careful. I'm like worried for both of us right now. Careful! Shh. Be fine. <laughs> Done. I did it. That's step one, complete, done. Blow dryer, curling spray, let's do this. I'm excited to see if this really works. I know this one's quite interesting. <laughs> done. Done. Pop that baby right in there. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. This is actually kind of cool. This is actually very cool. <laughs> It's melting the bottle. Okay, we don't want that. It's melting the bottle. Cause burnt plastic is- Oh my God, but it really did curl your hair. Wait, did it? Oh, cool. <laughs> Wait, but it's melting the bottle. Yeah, I feel like that's probably not the best thing. Look at it, it's pretty though. It's pretty. Is it Wait. melted bottle worth of pretty? Literally though, like what do you do when you melt the bottle? Okay, yeah. so don't put it on high heat. Uh, this time I'm gonna like comb it out. Okay. Make sure it's all nice and wet. Used to people pulling my hair anyway. I don't know how people make the bottle not melt. Yeah. Oh my god, though, that one worked oh. really well. Did it? Fun. I think out of all the hair hacks, I really think that the pineapple one was the best. <laughs> Wait, is this the side I already curled? Yeah. I didn't mean to do that. It's okay. I'm just gonna look like this. Why did this one not work as well? I don't know. <laughs> I just took a skinnier piece that time. Maybe I should take a thicker one again. Yeah, maybe. It's doing a cute little dance though. It looks like those like wacky inflatable flailing tube men a little bit. Okay, okay. Oh, cute. Okay. Water bottle hair hack comes through. I want to be done with this. <laughs> <laughs> be done with it too. <laughs> I don't think that one really was the best. If you got the hang of it, it'd be kind of cool. Like just because it gives you kind of natural waves. Yeah. <laughs> That's one like, way of putting it. I didn't it. hate it. I mean, I think the foil one worked a lot better though. Yeah, yeah. 
But I think the real winner of the styling hacks was the pineapple bun. Yeah. I like, agree. SpongeBob, mm -hmm. be proud. Mm -hmm. Yeah. More importantly, um, Taryn Egerton, are you are you proud? <laughs> Go on. <laughs> and what do you call that? Hair hack! Yeah. <laughs> oh, you guys. That was a day of hacks. Yeah, I don't know if hacks is like the exact word for something, uh, yeah. but... I feel like yeah. we hacked it. I feel like we definitely had a lot of fun, but I don't think um, we'd be really using any of those hacks for anything in the near future. I think maybe the pineapple one. I don't know. The, the hair pineapple mask. one was the most, yeah. I think the most useful yeah. for Mel, in yeah. Mel's case. I don't know if I could pull off the pineapple. Yeah. Um, were you the one in the hack though? <laughs> Hack wasn't built for me. And make sure you guys follow both Mel and Eric on Instagram. This is their handles, they'll be linked below. And make sure you follow me, Bradmondo NYC, on Twitter and Instagram. And follow Xmondo, my bae, my hair care line, for updates on new product launches. And that is all for today's hacking video. Woo! Hope you guys enjoyed it. Give it a like if you did. And thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to live your extra lives. And I will see you all next time. Peace! <laughs>